everybody, welcome back to another episode of Small Business 101 here on Our About You. Yes, and uh, we have a great episode, right? So, hiring, something every small business needs to do. Uh, we're talking about do references matter when hiring? Well, I've never once called somebody's reference, so. And look at the quality of employee he has. Yeah. Um, I mean, I don't know if it's, uh, I don't know if they matter. It's, I'm a bad person to ask that to. I mean, I, I personally actually never called somebody's reference because I feel like if you're giving a reference, you're giving some, no one's going to put a reference down that's going to be like, oh, I hate this person. Yeah, and that's my thing, right? Like, if I'm asking for a reference, I'm not putting down the people that I know. I'm gonna, I know, like, it's people that are going to love me, right? Like, mm -hmm. so I'm going to put that down versus, like, like when I leave here, Palms is going to be my reference, right? Because she loves me. Um, so I put that down on a reference versus, like, the people you know that don't like you. So it's just, it's like... It's like asking someone, you know, to rate themselves. It just seems kind of like biased already. Yeah. So. Yeah. Um, and I'm pretty sure I don't. I'm always if I even called somebody's reference. I don't know. If, I'm sure there's like, you probably can only ask them certain things. Um, there's probably legality behind yeah. it. Yeah. But um, I don't know. Calling if you know if you knew somebody that what I would do is or I've done this before though. Somebody would apply here, um, and. I know. I noticed that they're connected with somebody on LinkedIn that I know, and I'll ask them. But they're not. They weren't listed as a reference. I think that's. Yeah, I've done that before. Have you? No. Well, I mean, I've called people like someone. You know, we heard a story about someone, and we called the person to like verify, and they were like, "Yeah, I know they're great." Like, obviously, don't get too detailed. But mm -hmm. so that's the only time we've ever done a reference. But for the most part, we don't even ask for them. Yeah. You know, we probably should. It's probably a great idea. I mean, they're always on the. They're, they're not there. Most yeah. We'll give them. There's one thing on here that says like, if someone can't come up with a reference, it's probably a red flag. Can, uh, yeah, I would agree with that, but it, could somebody not come up with a reference? I don't know, I bet you could. Like if you like, if you go from job to job and you're constantly like fired because like, you, you know, you just list a coworker that you worked with them, you wouldn't list a manager maybe, I mean, yeah. Yeah, I mean, you like, could, I guess. You have a friend that you could put down. I mean, you know. My brother. Yeah, someone's yeah. gonna list the, you're gonna, it, maybe if you can't list like a, if you couldn't leave one of your like, you know, um, whoever you reported to, like if you if all your reference maybe that's a red flag. If all your references are friends or or coworkers rather than like people that you reported to, yeah, I could see that. I never thought about that. That would be a yeah. Like if it's just like, mm -hmm. if it's like you know, your entire your entire reference network is just people you work with, but no like supervisor or whatever word you want to use. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's obviously a red flag. Let us know if you check references. Yeah, or not. Let us know either way. Yeah. But always watch, and we'll see you next week. Thanks for watching.